Hi and um, welcome to the video. In this video I'm just going to show you how to set up a Fastos Pop or IMAP mailbox on an Android device. Now depending on your version of Android and your device you're setting it up on you might not see exactly the same as what I'm seeing here but the process is going to be very very similar. So to start the first thing we need to do is go to the devices settings. So if you find that app on your device and from here we're going to go to accounts. Now here you're going to see a list of um, your existing accounts and we just tap in add account there. And here you're going to see a list of all the apps you can add an account for. I'm just going to add, uh, add it into the Gmail app. Uh, as you can see that I've got Outlook and if you've got any other mail apps on your phone they'll appear here too. But I'm going to use Gmail for now so I'm going to do a personal IMAP account. So here we're entering the email address we're trying to set up. doing bob at fastwayswebinars.com and I'm going to tap manual setup for that one. So it is, I'm going to set up as IMAP but you could use POP3 if you wanted to. So the password for the mailbox is what you enter here. And here we're entering the incoming server settings. So the Username is your full email address, password is your mailbox password, and the server name is mail.livemail.co.uk. Now, just in case you have any issues with ports, if you get a pop-up or anything, the incoming server setting, the port number should be 993 for IMAP, or if you're using POP, it would be 995. But generally speaking, you won't need to worry about that. So outgoing server settings, uh, port number would be 465. Again, you won't need to worry about that unless you get a request from your phone. Um, require sign in needs to be on. And again, username is your full email address, password is your mailbox password, and the SMTP server is smtp.livemail.co.uk. So tap next on that. And then you just get some account options, so the sync frequency. Again, that's specific to this app, so you might be using a different one. Next, and it's just connecting, and it says your account is set up and your emails are on way. And that is all you need to do now. So if I tap next on there, you'll see that that's added to my accounts list, and that should be the same for um, any sort of any apps you're using too. And that's all there is to it. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye for now.